Welcome back Pokefans to the Pokemon Jasmine playthrough so last episode we made our way to Carve City got attacked by a bunch of combis but then someone saved us who turned out was the gym leader Ruby we explored Carve City and then went and took on the gym itself and we met a new Pokemon called B-Strong I'm assuming it's a male evolution of um, combi but I'm not 100% sure on that we did see a sort of encounter with a Vespiquen, which looks a little different, so we're gonna head there and do this. Oh. Okay, that's different. I was not expecting that. So what is it, Bug Psychic? Well, we don't do much damage to it, let's put it that way. Right, let's do a bit more damage. I wonder if I can catch it or not. I'm going to say you probably can't and that just took out both of them critical hit as well right down to the last two out comes cube toys as well um, let's see oh no you can't catch it Okay, let's go for a rock blast. Why? What? Why didn't we attack? Uh, there we go. We got TM for side shot there. But I kind of want to catch that Pokemon. I'm still trying to figure out which button actually speeds up, and I've just accidentally run around. No, still can't figure it out. Okay, so I'll fast forward to when we're back in Carve City so we can continue to the next town. Okay, so we're back. Um, I figured out how you actually speed the game up. It's the alt button. And along the way, we also caught a male combi. So I'm hoping it just evolves by level up because if it's anything else, then I have no idea. So let's head on down. Ooh, Pokex, what are you doing here? I see, so you've completed the second gym challenge. I'm very proud of you. I'm here because my friend Topus has asked me for help with a project. You already know her, she's the architect of inventions such as the Pokeball, the PC or the experience share. That's why I was trying to get to Kinetic City but these little trees got in my way. This is perfect for me, I can teach you how to cut them. Go ahead Noctowl. Come on Noctowl, use cut. Right, with a move cut you can cut down the small trees that are in the way. Here so you can do it too. Well, I'm going to continue on my way. I hope we meet again soon. Oh, you kind of just left it open for us. Let me see if you can just cut it. Oh, no, you have to actually teach it someone. I suppose it'd be for it. Oh, it's a grass move. Okay. I suppose we'll get rid of scratch. And then chop it down. Uh huh. Okay, so it looks like there's a new Pokemon here. Just whether we can find it or not. If you defeat me, we can pray together, it'll be fun. A Chinuna. 
Let's see how much crit does. Not a lot. Okay, we'll switch to cube toys. Let's go for a razor leaf. Rock blast. And Gothita. Um, yeah, we'll have staying. Just go for bite. Nice and easy. My god. Just healed up there for the sake of it. Oh, who's this? The inhabitants of Ecclesia should be grateful to Arceus. He saved us from a very dark time. There's a lot of them statues everywhere. Timber. Right, what else can we find? Nick it. Not sure which way we're supposed to go. I find the figure of the flowers quite gratifying. Okay, so instead of going that way, we're going to go this way first. I'm not leaving here until I win a fight. Youngster Julia. Julia. Um, we'll switch to cube toys. See what your rock blast does. Lovely. Um, Tynamo, same again, rock blast. And then a Minnow will also rock blast that. Absolute cakewalk. Well, nothing to continue standing a while longer. There is actually loads of statues here. After passing through Plaster Town, I discovered the real truth. Let me show it to you. Okay, Priest Benedicto. Um, switch to Cube Toys. Not gonna lie, that's a little bit terrifying. Cube toys to the rescue. And um, we'll get rid of double slap, I suppose. And then a goldie, we can just stay in and raise a leaf. I'd, I'd have got so mad if we got confused there. This will not change things. Okay, so I don't know if we're actually going the right way. The dogma faction is wrong. They must be wrong. It can't be that what they showed me is true. Again, there's a lot of these people, but none of it seems to make any relevance yet. Okay, so we'll have to go all the way back. <coughs> At work, they pick on me and call me a detective. Why? Silence, I ask the questions here. All right, jackass. Is this even the way we came? I don't think it is. This is the farthest I've ever been from home. Explorer Matthias. Right, cube toys and razor leaf. Up next is Star You, but that um, accuracy drops a little bit annoying. And then a core fish as well. I cannot stop here. I mean, I'm kind of hoping that this just brings us to the same place, which I think it did. So it doesn't look like we missed anything. So we can just, I'm just gonna have a, a quick run around, see if we can find that. Um, let's see if we can catch it now. Oh, it gets fake out. Right, let's throw a Pokeball. 
nice and easy. So what if this evolves into something? It just says Monia. Um, let's have a look at. It's got Friend Guard. Looks more like a support one, I suppose. Although, I'm not too sure. You'll stay on the team for now because obviously it's a new Pokemon. But we can head on through here. And we've arrived at Plaster Town. Oh, hope you haven't forgotten about me. I just got my second badge and if you're here, I'm sure it's because you got yours too. Do you remember what I told you last time? Well, bam, here I am. I'm going to show you how strong young Esmeralda is. Alright then, let's have this rival battle. Squovy, um, we'll switch into Pancham. Just a rock smash. Oh my god. Healed up so much HP there. A Krabid, what's a Krabid? What is that? Kind of looked like it was doing a little dance with its claws. And then out comes more while. Um, to be honest, you don't really have an answer for this. Power up punch is a little bit terrifying. I think we're just going to have to keep spamming it. It's not the end of the world if we go down. Next we're going to Poliwag. Your super potion, that is pure cheating. Come on, get the speed drop. Party bag coming in clutch again. That hypnosis. Yeah. But how could this happen? I beat two gyms just like you. I shrank from my team. And still I couldn't win. Because I guess you're stronger than you seem. Well, just know that it was pure luck. It will not happen again, I assure you. I will defeat the gyms before you and become strong. Faster, more powerful, even better. Come on, the Dogma Faction ceremony is about to begin. Today's will be given by one of the bishops himself in person. We still have time, people are still arriving. Looks like the eye guys are going to make another presentation. What? How? Do you know them too? Heard them once give a sermon in Canova City and they said a lot of nonsense. We also learned a couple of things, it can be interesting. I know I said it would make me stronger, but well, the gym's not going to move, are they? Well, I'll wait for you in the square, come as soon as possible, don't miss it here. Eh? Well, we're going to have to heal up first. And then we're going to have a quick look around, see if we can find any goodies. I get angry too quickly, Father, I can't help it. Normally I'm calm, but suddenly, ah, okay, you're definitely crazy. In the plaster church, they're always falling asleep. I'm calm and praying here. Man's words cannot convince man. That is why the Dogma Faction has so many followers. They are divine words transmitted directly by our God. Okay, I'll take your word on that. Um, let's see what we can find then. I've come a long way to see what these guys have to tell. I hope I'll not be disappointed. Can't go that way. Let's check this house. I love moves like absorbing Giga Drain. You steal HP from the target and keep it for yourself. The Dogma Faction have settled in this village since I was a child, but since they've got that eye on their suit, it looks like a different organisation. Okay. Couldn't quite understand what was being said there. Everyone can choose what to believe in, that is beautiful in its own way, but when you meet the faction, you begin to understand that there is only one right answer. 
Since I've been in the dogma faction, I am much happier. Soon our saviour will come and we will know true salvation. Yeah, we haven't really had much going on with them yet. Lately I see some of the factions sleeping in the corners. What's going on? Victor tells Joel, get on my motorboat. But for now, Joel tells Victor, have an egg for breakfast. But at the moment, Victor tells Joel, take a mango. Then suddenly Joel says to Victor, I'd like to be a fly to stand on your skin. At the moment, Victor tells Joel, I am me. At the moment, Joel tells Victor, Merry Christmas. That, yeah, that doesn't make any sense to me. As the boat passes, the boatman told me, Pretty girls board first. Oh. Had a great time with you. I'm going to give you a little present I found in my pocket. Oh, rare candy. Lovely. Right, well, looks like you can't go through there either. Okay, so we're going to have to head up. I can't wait, my intuition tells me that something big is going to happen. What a thrill, I've never seen a bishop in person. Okay, we've got another inn. Loads of freebies again, please. Isn't Plastown beautiful this time of year, don't you think? Ooh, this guy's asleep. Doesn't look like you can get next to him there. Can't disturb him. I used to go shopping every day until he injured my knee. Now my son goes. Trainers nowadays, they're such weaklings. Anyone wanting to have their Pokemon with all their HP covered? These things did not happen before King Dioro becomes soft. Okay, there's nothing actually in this inn for us. Big letdown. Right, where else can we go? Ooh. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. So yeah, got this cutscene, I suppose. Welcome to today's sermon. Allow me to show my appreciation for the public today. I even see a couple of new faces. Having said that, I have no choice but to respond to your gratitude with a presentation of myself. My name is Jasper, and I'm proud to hold the position of bishop within the Dogma faction. Being a bishop has its advantages. You can see things that others never could. All of us in the Dogma Faction followed the instructions of our God. He showed us the lies of this world and promised us a saviour who would change things. Many people within the Faction have not even been able to see it. They only follow us in the hope of having some day better. But as I said, being a bishop has its own advantages. And I'll take this moment to show you all one of the secrets of the Dogma Faction. This is a mystical Mienfu, a Pokemon that belonged to the other world. Thanks to them, the faction has discovered the secrets and lies of this world. With them, we were able to remove the blindfold put on us by King Dioro. Only the bishops and the cardinal are allowed to use the mystical Pokemon. Controlling them is not easy. Doing this is already something that my peers would see as inappropriate, but I had to show my gratitude to this audience in some way. But in the Dogma faction, we are generous, so everyone present will receive a mystical Pokemon. Oh, snap. How cool is your Mienfu? He also gave me one. I knew we had to listen to what they were saying. Still, I don't find it very funny when they talk that way about our king. For my part, there is nothing more to say. Take good care of our gift. But... Why do you say those things? What has King Dioro done to you? Interesting question, ma'am. May I ask who you are? I'm Esmeralda and this is Pokex and we are rivals. Pokemon trainers, huh? We in the Dogma Faction don't really like trainers. Sometimes they can be a bit curious. But if you're so insistent on knowing the truth, I'll let the mystical Pokemon show you. Enjoy the world of dreams. Okay, what the hell is going on? Contemplate this, Dioro. Everything that appears through the window belongs to us. The region of Ecclesia has never been so large. This, I, I can't go on with this. Many people have died. We have blood on our hands, we have no allies, only distant regions that are afraid of us. And, their lives didn't matter, they were foolish infidels, unable to see how wrong they were. Our reign is the time of light in the region. 
Neighbouring regions do not fear us, they respect us and envy us for not being able to sacrifice as much as we do to prosper. This is exactly what I was referring to. I don't want to have to sacrifice anything else. This is my kingdom, my people. You mean ours, don't you? You would never have gotten to where you are without me. You were just the fa facade of what I built. I'm truly sorry, Leonark. You will always be my Pokemon partner. I want to be a king, not a dictator. You can't do this to me, Diara. You're not going to get rid of me that easily. I'm going to send you back to the dream world with the rest of the mystical Pokemon, which we should never have taken you out of. I will tell everyone that something was controlled in my mind, but Arceus has saved me and I am now free. Today, the golden age of this region will begin. Hey, what are you doing here? You should not have seen that memory. It should be mine alone, you know. I guess can't be helped after all. We are in the dream world. What? I see, so the Dogma faction can control mystical Pokemon and they got you in here. It seems he was too gullible to think that they would keep them here forever. Let me ask you, what is your name? Pokeax, nice name. Nice to meet you Pokeax, I'm Diana and I've been here for a long long time. I can get you out of here but it's no use if you can't take on the mystical Pokemon. So you're going to have to listen to what I have to say and trust me. Mystics are perfect, nothing can defeat them, they live in this dream world where nothing disturbs them. But that ends as soon as they arrive in our world, normality and imperfection contaminate them and they become weak. The forces of nature also help to resist their strength. Lean on normal fire, grass, water and bug type Pokemon. This will help you deal with them. It can be dangerous if he finds out you are here. So it's time to wake up just as they were able to get you in. I can get you out. That's why you should never forget I am with you. Okay then. Let's smack up this Mian Fu. Goes down to one attack. What happened? What? Can a mystical Pokemon give given to us put us to sleep like this? It would be dangerous if it happens to more people. I'll go and talk to those who receive one like us to keep them away. In the meantime, you just hang around the plaster church to see what they're up to. Good luck. Okay. Pretty crazy, but we've got a little bit of a glimpse into I suppose the legendary of this game but um, yeah interesting dogma faction sounds pretty interesting as well but yeah next episode we will continue exploring see if there's anything else going on before we make our way to the next town thank you everyone for watching and hope to see you all next time